gentlemen, Steve, Jeff, Baron, this is Grant Cardone videoing from Hollywood, California. Baron sent me an email two days ago saying, hey Grant, could you put together a little clip so the people here, the executives here that shoot TV and make decisions could see exactly what you would do when you come to the UK and give a turnaround version my turnaround uh, TV show version in the UK. So rather than me telling you what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do is use my own personal business. Let's face it, all businesses fail. The question is, do they fail long term or just short periods of time? So when we go, when I go into a company, what I'm looking for is the real problems. The people in the business don't know the problems. If they knew the problems, they wouldn't have them. So what I do is I go into a company and identify real, actual problems. I, I tell you what, rather than me telling you, follow me. I'll show you what I do. This is the sales department, okay? I'm going to blow in on the sales department and show them how to sell something. That's going to increase morale, it's going to drive revenue, and it's going to make the business successful. That's what people all over the world are not doing. This is a guy on a phone call right now. He's having trouble. Okay. I'm going to intervene. I'm going to drop in. Not discuss okay. that. I'm going to drop in. Okay. So why don't, why don't I do this? I'll give you a call at the end of the month, and then we can see where we're at and see if things change. Let me have that call. Oh, wow. Really? This is Carlos. Hey, Carlos. Hey, your business is here. Grant Cardone here. How you doing? Yes, this is. This is Grant Cardone, sir. Oh my God, Grant Cardone, Grant Cardone. Why are you here? Hey, never thought I'd be talking to you on the phone. I'm always talking to you. Well, you, you know what? You're talking to me right now. Hey, and and the reason I'm jumping on this call, Carlos, is because I heard Jared. Say something about he's going to call you back next month. Yeah, I need some time to look at this thing, man. I want to finish out my month. Okay, but let me ask you something. Why did you look at it in the first place? Well, I have an interest in training, man. I have an interest in getting my people trained. And why do you why do you have an interest in getting your people trained? Well, obviously, the better trainer or the more revenue is, the less expensive. Okay, so what's important to you? What problem are you trying to solve? Well, you know, I want to I want to get them to be able to handle all the situations that they encounter, man. I want to get my green teas better trained. I want to get my veterans excited again. You know, I mean, I'm just, I'm trying to survive like anybody, man. I'm trying to expand my good and and. and Carlos, excuse me, but do you feel like you're missing opportunities right now? Yes. Oh, yeah, man. I mean, we all have. Good. So you didn't call Jared. You didn't show interest in our product because you wanted to save money. You you called Jared because you want to increase your income by your revenue, by ha having your people better handle situations, get your veterans experience, and get your green, your newer salespeople trained. Can you hear him? Yeah, but I just don't want to spend month on your product is what he's asking too. I mean, can't you guys do better than that? $1,500 a month is pretty high, man. Well, the 1500 a month, th okay. that's your objection? Is the cost? See, he's moved already. Well, that's one yeah. of the objections. Okay. $1,500 a month, I just kind of wrap my arms around that. Yeah, well, let me let me explain to you that it's not 1500 a month, it's $36,000. Is that yourself? Plus the four thousand dollar startup fee, which means it's forty thousand. I need you to think about a forty thousand dollar decision, not a fifteen hundred dollar a month decision. Okay, you're going to be on this program two years, not one month. If you're not going to be on it two years, you need to tell me that up front because then we don't need to do it. It won't work anyway. Let me ask you a question, okay. Carlos. I will. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. As soon as he's When's the last program. time your company spent forty thousand okay. dollars? Thank you. We probably spend uh, spend almost that a month on advertising. Uh huh. Have you ever had it not work? Well, you can't ever really put a finger on it, but I'm sure you know it's working somehow. We want to keep spending the money. Right. So look, you're going to spend forty thousand dollars to train your people over two years, over two years, to handle every opportunity that comes to you, and you spend four hundred and eighty thousand dollars in the same period of time on advertising. This represents basically. 8% of your ad budget. Do you want to train your people? Do you want them motivated? If so, if you're going to do this sooner or later, if you're going to do this sooner or later, I'm, I'm going to suggest, and that's why I'm getting on the call, take time out of the equation and let's do this. The reason I got on the call was to assure you that I'm here to support you and help you.
Look, Carlos, no, tell, if, 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 tell, if, tell, if, tell him to fax me a contract. Jesus Christ. Carlos, I appreciate your business. Thank you, buddy. Okay, and also, Great hey, we, we, I can't we, believe I got a chance to talk to you. That was dynamite. Hey, let me. Get on well, that's what everybody should be doing right now to make businesses work so they survive and prosper. What's your What's your home address? I want to send you something personal for me. Nine thirty five Eldridge, Sugarland, Texas, seven seven four seven eight. You got horses? Yes, sir, I do. What What's the, What's the zip code again? I missed it. Seven seven four seven eight. Okay, good. Do you have any Do you have any uh, concerns about doing this? Yes. No, man. You know my concern was the money, money, but I mean, what? you know, the way you the way you explained it to me, it makes sense, man. I mean, yeah. it's a no brainer. Yeah, that's right. You know, would there be any reason? Right. Would there be any reason you would change your mind? No, man. I'm not going to change my mind. Let's go forward. I'm with it. If I think I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. I'm sending it to you right now. Thank you so much for your business, and look look for your mailbox. Look in your mailbox for for a, something special. Mary. Thank you, man. Great talking to you. Okay, thank you. So, see what you do is, look, it's not always going to work like that, but if the executive drops in, brings in the altitude, brings in the enthusiasm, even if I would have failed, I restore my sales department. They see that I'm watching. They see that it's happening. Now, they see success. That's what I want to come to the UK and do to wake the UK up. John Faber, I know John. Yeah, he, yeah. he has an agreement right now. Yeah, okay. Sure, John Faber? Yeah. Yeah, I know John. You want to call him? Yeah, sure. You still, you still recording? Yeah. Can you just cut this? No, yeah, yeah, dude, totally. So here's another, here's another client right now that's close, but they'd like to talk to me. Let's just see what happens in this call. Again, look, these are, these are completely crazy, random, happens all day long, happens to every business, it happens in the cupcake business, it happens in the vacuum cleaner business, the furniture business, the motorcycle business. See Armando, he's not making enough phone calls. How's he going to ever get a chair? Hey John. Get a chair now. Yeah. Hey John, it's David Bradley with Grant Cardone's. I got John a Faber. What's up? What's up buddy? Long time. I know it's cool. I, uh, I wish you would call me on my landline. Hang on a minute. Let me put this on speakerphone. Yeah, do you want me to call you on your landline? What? You want me to call you on your landline? Yes. Please. What's What's the number? 225-756. So you got to wonder what's the best use of time for the executive right, we'll manager. Right Look, I want to drive revenue. I want to increase the revenue of the company. That is the, the grease for the machinery. It's money. It's, sorry. Particularly over there right now with this second recession you're experiencing, it's money. you got to drive the cash register. And the only way to do that is to talk to customers, to interact with customers, to touch customers, to get involved. A meeting's not going to do it. Organizing's not going to do it. Hey, man. What's up, player? Everything's good. Everything's good? Yeah, man. Good, uh, good. I, I think the last time I saw you, I ran into you at uh, NADA. Yeah, it was at that big convention, right? Vegas, that's right. That's good, right. man. Business good for you? Yeah, we've had a good year. Yeah, David, what? good? Yeah, I'm right here. Everybody's good. David's right here. Good. Uh, and we, we were just telling your uh, Brad, Bradley, David Bradley, that... We raised you from a pup. You did, man. Y'all are responsible for me. That's right. We got you. We got you kickstarted. Yeah, you back, did. Back I, when you used to have to do your own selling. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. We just, we're just glad to know that somebody's famous has come from Louisiana. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm trying. I'm working on doing something to elevate that to another level. So. Yeah. Um, hey, are you sitting with a contract in front of you for me? Yes, we are. I uh, told Bradley that as long as you come along with the deal, you come do your deal, we're ready to sign up today. What do I need to do, brother? you got to come over here and kick it off. Oh, man, I can't come all the way over there and kick this thing off. Dude, I'm so busy, but I, can, I tell you what I can do. We, I can drop in virtually. I can drop in live on a Skype or a Google Plus call. Okay. All right, we'll do that. You know, and I'll do, hey, look, you know, I'll do... I'll do one of those to kick it off, but I can do more. You know, if you call me up and give me like 60 days notice, I'll just put it on my calendar, you know, maybe when we're 60 or 90 days into the deal and, and, and do another one for you. All right. So if this was Fox News, you'd make it over there, wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah, because that's a million people, dog. 
<laughs> okay, so, um, uh, I, what are you going to do for us? Go down. Um, let me see, what do I have, what do I have in front of him? If you, if you want to open the numbers with him, he's got a, what's the contract say? What, what's the contract say? Oh, uh, it's negotiable, huh? Uh, the setup fee, setup fee is a thousand plus three thousand if we want you to, if we want you to uh, kick it off. Yeah, so it's going to be four thousand dollars, twelve ninety-five for twenty-four months. To get together with you and have a chat. Uh, I know that uh, you were going to get. Yeah, you guys, that's if you come live. Jaguar. No, no, no. That's if I come over the over over virtual. How potentially incorporate. How many guys you running with? We don't want to pay three thousand to hear you on the phone. No, man, you want that. I'm telling you, it's for the setup. Okay, I'm actually giving you that. You, you definitely want that. Is that David or John? It's John. Yeah, you want that, man. I'm telling you, I'll kick this thing off so hard. First of all, David is going to kick it off with your management team to show them how to set it up. Then I'm going to either come in two weeks or four weeks into the program. I don't. I don't. I'd, I'd prefer to do it after they've been on in a while to come in and start answering their questions. So, uh, you know, 90 days into the deal, you want me to do another one? We're friends. I'll do another one for you. Okay, so you can Don't, wave your feet. Yeah, sure. And the, yeah, going forward. Like, look, whatever y'all want me to do, I'll do going forward. Just ask me to do it, and I'll do it. Okay, so set up fees 1000 Is that right? No, no. The, the, why Why you want to do that to me, man? Why you want to nickel and dime me like that? That's not. Look, you got you to make it on somebody else. You know how that is. Yeah. Come on. All right. So, so what are we gonna do? I mean, this is retail. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, you're you're saving $600 a month. How's that? This is normally 1,800 bucks. What is? The the oh. agreement. Oh. Do y'all want me to do unlimited support for you, or do you want do you want to nickel and dime me up front on the deal? Well, what's unlimited support? You call me up and say, Grant, do another 20-minute, 30, 40-minute meeting for us. Let's do one in December, Grant. Let's do one in March, Grant. Let's do one in June. Uh, well, well, okay, well, let's like that. I charge, look, I charge four grand a pop for those, okay? You do four a year for every quarter. How about that? Just call, you, you want me to do one every month. If I can put it on my calendar, I'll do it. No, 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 no. How about a quarter? You're a busy man. How about you do it every quarter for us? I, I'm just saying, you guys call me and tell me when you want me to do it, and I'll put it on my calendar. That's what I'm telling you. Well, we'll be flexible with your calendar. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. We'll do that. Four grand, twelve ninety five. I'm sending it to you right now. Any reason you change your mind? No, I'm doing it right now. But I'm gonna put on here quarterly. You're gonna, you're gonna do a little. Bing. Right. You want, that's right. That's the American way, right? More, more is better. I'm in. All right, I'll send it over. Send it back over. Ink it. Send it back over. Get your guys on it for two weeks, and we'll schedule the first one. Okay, David Bradley, I'm gonna call you here in a few minutes. I'm here. Hey, love you guys. Who do you know? Who do you know other than yourself that would be interested in doing this? No, a lot of people. Well, as soon as we get on it, I'll still give you. Now you already know me well enough. Who would you think of when I asked that question? We're in two twenty groups right now, cool. Okay. When can I speak to to one of the groups? Well, you gotta. I gotta make sure it works as good as you. Say it does before hey. I give you all these names. I don't want to recommend you unless I. You know who recommend? You know who brought your name up the other day? The twenty group was uh, Brian from Paragon. Yeah, yeah. He's been on this thing eighteen months. Yeah, he, he loves it. Okay, so who do you guys know? Come on, Sh share the crawfish. Guys, uh, let me go. I'm gonna come back. I know that Brian and Sewell. I'm at Sewell Group. Yeah. You ever do any business with them? No. About, uh, Who's your best friend in the group? Your best friend in the group, who is it? Best friend, Rick, uh, Rick Coward with Sewell. Okay, okay. Can you get me a meeting with him to show this to him? Well, I got to see it. I ain't even seen it yet. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, you trust me? Can you send me 50 pounds of crawfish then? I'm send you some money. Can you send me 50 pounds of crawfish? Yeah, right. Hey, it's, it's crawfish season's over, Cole. You know that. When, 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 good ones. When's crawfish coming? When, when are they coming? Spring season. You got to come in the spring for that. All right. Okay, man. Give, get, get, summer, hey, give me to come right speak now. to your 20 group, all right? Hey, I've got a 20 group meeting coming up. You there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, I got a 20 group meeting I'm going to Monday. Uh -huh. Actually, Sunday I'm leaving. So okay, where? We'll see. It's in Philadelphia. Okay, I don't want to go to Philadelphia. 
well, anyway, I'm in a, uh, I got, I'm in an Infinity 20 group. David's in an Accurate 20 group. Okay. So Paragon, the guy at Paragon's one, of course we knew about you, but Paragon was yeah. singing your praises the other day. Right. In one of the groups. Okay. In his group. Okay. So, uh, but no, I got some really heavy hitters in, uh, in mine, in the Accurate, in the Infinity See, group. That's how it works, okay. That's how it you know, works. guys from Houston, guys How much more I got to show you? Like, say, Sewell. That's uh, 30, guys from the West Coast. 32. Like, uh, Dave Pilo. $80,000 you know, in revenue in 10 minutes. Cardone? Yes, sir. I say, you know, uh, is it uh, Dave Milo or, uh, oh, shoot. I've got a, a, I don't really know all the guys because I've only been to one group, but there's some other other people okay, well, just give me, you know, maybe put me on the agenda Sunday. Say, hey, can we bring Cardone in? He's doing business with Ben Stock. I'm doing business with Rick Case. You know, you, 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 yeah, yeah. I'll bring it up. I'd love to hang out with y'all. Come and stay an extra night. We'll, we'll throw back some Don Julio. <laughs> you the man. Okay, buddy. Right, Th buddy. Thanks for your business. I appreciate it. See you. Bye. Okay, the, 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 there's a good example, okay? My guy David might have been able to take the deal all the way, but this added fuel to the fire, okay? Gets it hot in here. They're like, oh, my God, we can do business. And it might have speeded up the process. This is what we need to do for a TV show in the U.K.